I'm here on Anglesey with the uh, the Dive Society. Um, they came up to me a little while ago and asked me if I'd come and do a dive with them, and so I'm here today to come and explore. I have been promised kelp forests, cat sharks, uh, hermit crabs, anemones, all kinds of wonders, and hopefully crystal clear waters and sunny, sunny skies. I take my position as a lecturer here at Bangor University very seriously. It's a part of the world I, I feel really connected to. And to come here and meet the students, you know, see their day-to-day -day life, get to do things like this with them, it is massive for me. And also I get a real chance to chat to them about what they want to do in the future, the kind of things they'd like to do. And if they're, it's in my realm, then to help them and to give them suggestions and ideas and contacts and all that sort of thing. And that happens best on a social like today. What is that I'm about to see? Uh, kelp. Yeah. Uh, hopefully some cat sharks. Hopefully a load of hermit crabs. Hermit crabs? Kermit crabs. <laughs> are, they, are they green? Maybe. <laughs> Let's see, shall we? <laughs> that sounds fantastic. I mean, seriously, I live on the Thames, so basically it's shopping trolleys and old boots where I come from. What's, what's your favourite thing to see down here? I just love swimming down here, to be honest. It's like so beautiful and when it's clear, it's lovely. What's the best thing about the uh, University Dive Society? Oh, everything. I can't even pick one. Everything. Nice. We go out fun dives every week. Sometimes we see some stuff. Sometimes it's a bit sediment sedimenty. But if you love sediment, that's fine. <laughs> it's great. It's, there's a tagline for the society. If you love sediment, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> no, loving the pink fins, by the way. Very, very strong look. Right, should we go and get chilly? So if you could say one thing to anyone who was thinking about coming to Bangor University, why should they come? I mean, look around you. It's possibly one of the most beautiful places on earth. You're not really going to get sea, mountains, all with the bundle of education as well in the same place. I mean, I'm from Indonesia, one of the most beautiful countries in the world, and I still came here to study. Diving here is amazing. The Menai Straits especially. Uh, me, Re, and a few of our friends went there, and that was an awesome dive site down to about 18 meters at the bottom yeah. and there's blue lobsters that are like this long blue crabs a seabed of anemones like a millions down there it's such a gorgeous place the currents are like strong so it's a nice fun dive so much to see i think it's around here is such an amazing place to dive why is this such a great place in the uk to come and study wildlife environmental sciences that kind of thing oh it's just it's so hands-on there's so much you guys go out in the field, on the boat, on the beaches, actually carry out proper field work, which in most universities, it's a lot of lab and you don't get hands-on experience. Yeah. Nick, are you really, really cold? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just hell. You're so trying to get through the sentence. Just bless you, you need to get this hot chocolate, quick. <laughs> I came here because um, I essentially think that all the things that you said are, are so, so true. I think that um, universities can invest huge amounts of money in infrastructure, they can build new buildings, they can create all kinds of new structures, but they can't create the Menai Straits or Anglesey or Snowdonia. That, you know, there's, there's only one place in the nation, in the world, that has that. And I think that making the best use of those natural resources is, is the key to this being the best university in the nation. Woo!